Hi, this is 3C Experts, and today we want to talk to you about phishing emails and how to avoid them. Let's take a look at our first example. Here we have an email that says it's from GoDaddy.com. But in reality, these things can be spoofed. I can send it from my email, and then when you see it, it says it's from GoDaddy.com. So we can't just trust this. If we look at the email, it says somebody's been trying to enter our account and they've been using incorrect passwords and for our safety they've blocked our GoDaddy account. If we want to reactivate let's go to this link. This link looks real www.godaddy.com but if we do something called a mouse over which means place our mouse over the link but not click we'll see at the bottom left where the link is actually going. So if I click here this is where I would go dtnsk.ru this is going to a link in Russia. So if I were to click here, I would end up somewhere completely different than I think I would. So we need to be aware of this. Here's another email example. Uh, I got an email from Google Docs. It looks really official. Here's the logo. It says I have a secure document waiting for me. And if I follow this link, I can get that document. So let's follow the link and I come to another really official looking page logos I've seen this before we've definitely seen this before but it's not real it says we can sign in with any of our providers our username and password and then we'll be able to view the document but if I were to do this username and password what I'm actually doing is sending a hacker my username and password and they instantly have access to whatever account I put in one way to check to make sure we're on the correct site is if say we're on another Google Drive site, we look at the top left, we see the link where we actually are. It looks real, but if we look left, top left, we know where we are. And that's not where we want to be, so we need to get out of the situation immediately. So our quick tips for the video would be avoid following any links and emails. Always check URL links with a mouse over. Remember mouse over it, don't click it, and you'll see it at the bottom left. And if you have clicked a link to entered in your password and username, you need to change your password and username immediately. Not just for that account, but all accounts linked to that email or other accounts. Thank you, and have a good day.